In this video, let us know about a new concept. Here, three bags of same appearance has the following proportions of balls. Bag 1 has two black and one white ball. Bag 2 has one black and two white balls. And bag 3 has two black and two white balls. One bag is selected at random and a ball is drawn from it. The drawn ball turns to be white in color. Then, find the probability that the ball is drawn from bag 3. We all are familiar with such questions. Let us see how to solve such questions by using Bayes theorem. Before going to the solution, let us know what Bayes theorem states. According to Bayes theorem, if events E1, E2 up to En are mutually exclusive and exhaustive events such that probability of occurrence of any one event is greater than 0. Or we can say that probability of EI is greater than 0 for all i equal to 1, 2, 3, 4 up to n. Then for any arbitrary or a random event A such that probability of A is greater than 0 which is probability of occurrence of event A is greater than 0. Then we have the following formula. Probability of occurrence of EI given A is equal to probability of occurrence of EI multiplied by probability of occurrence of event A given EI. The whole divided by summation which is the sum of probability of EI multiplied by probability of occurrence of A given EI. Let us move towards the solution of the problem. Here it is given that bag 1 contains 2 black and 1 white ball. Bag 2 contains 1 black and 2 white balls. Bag 3 contains 2 black and 2 white balls. Let us consider event E1 of choosing bag 1, event E2 of choosing bag 2, event E3 of choosing bag 3. Now, the probability of choosing any one of these 3 bags is equal to 1 by 3 as we are choosing 1 bag from total of 3 bags which, is, which implies probability of E1 is equal to probability of E2 is equal to probability of E3 which is equal to 1 by 3. Let A be an event of drawing a white ball from the chosen bag. Now we have to find out the probability of drawing a white ball from each of these bags which can be represented by probability of A given E1 for choosing a white ball from bag 1 which can be given as as we are choosing uh, how many white balls are present in the bag 1? There is one white ball. So, we have 1 divided by number of ways of choosing white balls. As there are total number of 3 balls out of which we are choosing 1. So, we have written in the denominator 3C1 which is equal to 1 by 3. Now, we will find out the probability of choosing a white ball from bag 2. As the total number of white balls in bag 2 are 2 and divided by total number of balls are 3 and we are drawing only one ball out of it. So we are having a denominator of 3c1 which is equal to 2 by 3. Next we would find out the probability of drawing a white ball from bag 3 which can be represented as probability of a given e3. Here we have total number of two white balls. So we have written 2 in the numerator and in the denominator we would write out the number of ways of choosing one white ball. Here we have total number of balls is 2 plus 2, 4 and we are choosing one ball out of it. So we have written 4C1 which it can be written as 2 by 4. On simplifying we get 1 by 2. Now according to question we have to find out probability of choosing bag 3 and drawing a ball, white ball out of it which can be represented as probability of E3 given A. By using Bayes theorem, we can write the formula as probability of E3 multiplied by probability of A given E3 whole divided by summation i equal to 1 to we have here 3 bags. So, we will go from i equal to 1 to 3 probability of EI multiplied by probability of A given EI which can be simplified as probability of E3 multiplied by probability of A given E3 whole divided by first we have to put uh, 1 in the place of i then we would get probability of E1 multiplied by probability of A given E1 as we are using summation so we would use the symbol of plus 
Now we would go to the next value of i which is 2. So probability of occurrence of E2 multiplied by probability of A given E2 plus probability of E3 multiplied by probability of A given E3. On substituting the values we get 1 by 3 multiplied by 1 by 3 whole divided by 1 by 3 into 1 by 3 sorry this is 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 into 2 by 3 plus 1 by 3 into 1 by 2 on simplifying this we get 1 by 6 and after multiplying and uh, adding these fractions we get a value of 9 by 18 if this denominator fraction goes on to the numerator then we get 1 by 6 into reverse of it 18 by 9 on cancellation we get 1 by 3 thus the probability of choosing bag 3 for drawing a ball white ball is 1 by 3 hope you all understood this concept and like this video for more concept on aptitudes and mathematics topics do comment in the comment section thank you